All right. Nabushi is my main. There are many other characters I play and have taken to Rep 70, but with all of the heroes that have come along, she is still my favorite. I like her smooth flowing style. She's not overpowered and she's so close to being right, but she's not right at the moment. There are a couple of things that I would change and want to see change with Nobu. One being fixing why Nobushi is a low threat if she's getting ganked responsibly, responsibly now, and how she's not a big threat as a ganker. She's not a big threat when getting ganked since she can't threaten an opponent with anything to open him up. Hidden stance to kick is the closest thing to apply pressure, and that sometimes takes her out of range to land on the opponent. Many other characters can backwards light or dodge heavy their way into an unblockable or use a bash in their kit if the opponent is close to death and has a low revenge meter because you don't want to just feed revenge. But if they don't have that, they have charge unblockables like Hito, Konk, and Goki. There's only three heroes that I can recall on the top of my head on a 30 character roster that do not have a no strings attached unblockable or a bash opener. And that's PK, Nabushi, and Nusha. Out of the three, Nabushi is the worst. Is the absolute worst. Since Nusha has traps to open her opponent, while PK has the soft heavy feint to bleed that opens up her unblockable attacks. Nobu has no hyper armor, no unblockables, no traps, and no openers. And I don't count the hidden stance to kick as an opener. And you shouldn't either. Why? Because it's not. Just plain and simple. And Yubi doesn't see it that way either. Because if they did, they would have just left Shaolin the way he was and only being able to access his kick through key stance. I want Nabushi to be on par with other heroes. And there are two changes to her moveset that I think will do it. All heroes need to compete, but I just feel like Nabushi just needs a couple slight tweaks and she'll be right there. She doesn't need much. It's just working through the opener and the gank. So my first change to make is to make Nobu a similar threat in ganking situations that players currently feel with Shaman and PK when they are bleeding. Because currently, Nobu is the worst threat out of those three. I'm not talking about giving her anything that pens like Shaman, or a heavy soft feint to bleed like PK, rather something that is threatening to opponents and fits with her moveset. So, here it is. You guys give me your feedback. I want her zone to become unblockable Another one. and you shoot holes in that all you want because let me know because i'm trying to figure out the best way to get her where she needs to be so if you have a better idea let me know and with this unblockable zone and this is where it kind of can get a little iffy i want the first and second attack to be feignable now currently the second attack is feignable you can dodge out of it instead of hard feigning you can just dodge out of it you can also throw a heavy out of it. You can go hidden stance. Wait, I'm thinking about the sidewinder. What the hell? Anyway, so <laughs> let me stick. Let me get back to the topic here. So the first and second attack feignable. And also the thing with this unblockable zone is it's only going to be unblockable when you're locked on an opponent that is bleeding. So basically, I want her zone to become unblockable. And the first and second attack feignable when the locked on opponent is bleeding. This will make her more dangerous in ganks and team fights. And it provides some synchronization with her moveset. And it's also in line with her as a character. Because it's just building on that bleed. Very similar to PK. I don't think we lose anything that makes Nabushi Nabushi by doing this. And it wouldn't make her any more dangerous in 1v1 situations. It'd just be another tool that she can use and it'd be primarily used in fours. The second change I would make is to give her an opener. Very similar to Shaolin. I think this is the simplest part of the changes for her. Give her the forward dodge kick. Just give her the forward dodge kick. Or she can use her shaft to bash the opponent into a cobra strike. I kind of like the, the shaft to bash idea just to have something different instead of just giving everybody kicks like Orochi has a kick, Shaolin has a kick, you know what I mean? But I feel these changes would take her where she needs to be. So what do you think? Am I a crazy noble main thinking these changes will help? 
Do you think there are better changes for her than what I mentioned? Let me know. I'm not claiming to be an expert, but I've put a lot of hours into Nobu and wanted to state some quality of life changes I would like to see. So go ahead, hit the like, make a comment, hit the subscribe button. I appreciate the love from all of you. That's all I have for this one. Until next time, I'm out. <laughs> That's like that feeling you get on a roller coaster right there. When you look down, you're like, oh crap. You <laughs> Sounds like no minions. <laughs> I don't know why I just jumped down there like an idiot. Mm. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs>